G'day folks, it's Jetty here from AE Prospecting. All right, so if you have watched my last video, um, I was talking about putting some material and some acid. So just like pieces like this, um, which near my farm I think has a piece of um, gold hanging out, but we won't know till I put them in acid and check a few weeks later. So I've hand washed all this stuff um, with a toothbrush as well, scrubbed it. This stuff will be going in. Um, all these nice crystals will be going in too to see if we can wash them up. And these nice, nice crystal bits here too. So these are really cool and they will look pretty nice all washed up. This one is going in a acid bath by itself. Alright. And now these crystals, they can all go in too. see what they look like in a few weeks so I will we'll be continuing this video um, I might do a video of all these um, bits of material in a week's time or a few days just to see what they look like um, then in two weeks we'll pull them all out and have a proper look see how well they're cleaned up so all this stuff here and there be going in that bucket there all right so remember when i'm um, dealing with acids like this i should be wearing gloves but i am wearing a um pair of um safety goggles and the wind is um uh, blowing in the opposite direction so that's good for me all right all right guys so we are back a week later i said we'd be back two weeks later but i think these are ready still clear and our little potential specimen we'll have to see what that looks like so remembering that these were like that so dirty stained um, I even wash these with a toothbrush and look at them so acid has done a great job so we'll pull out these wash them and this little piece of wool here and all this other stuff in here we'll pull out that and see if there's any gold so let's see how nice and clear these are that off okay that isn't that fantastic Some of 
it's not for long. Right, yeah, so we'll go ahead and put these all in a water bath, get the acid off them. Um, we'll do the same with this potential specimen. Um, then I'll wash all this stuff up here and I'll show you the damn result. Cool. Right, watch this. Crystal clear. Oh, yeah. Let's see if we have any gold from this guy. visible gold yet. That's right. We'll let it soak in there and have a proper look later. Cool, cool. Alright, so they're all washed up and look how clear they are. Look at this. That is awesome. That is really nice. Beautiful, clear quartz. And these ones, some of my favourites. Three and one, or four and one. Two little guys down here. Two big fellas up here. Just like this bit. It's really nice. It's like an arrow through a stick, almost. So you just remember how dirty these were and now they are absolutely crystal clear. It's awesome. And for our little specimen, we don't have a specimen. So I think it was just the ball night that was showing on this face. Um, and then a goldish little thing that I thought was a piece of gold. Must have been some ball night. But that's alright. Still got some nice crystals. And for our little bit of blue rock, I think that is actually a piece of glass. That's okay. Right here, so remember, they look like this all dirty stained. And these. Um, quartz clusters. I have some just over here. So these are pretty nice. Some of these guys. So we've got nice ones like that.
is a critical one that we need here it is. So you've got crystals going to the left and crystals going straight up. So that's pretty cool. Then we've, we, we have a few more in here. I won't show you all of them. Then we have some nice little pieces of um, sulfides that have exposed through acid treatment. So they're not bad either. So yes, it is very good. Um, that's it. That worked very well on our material. So in this straight acid. There's probably going to be some fines in there that I will get all bassed out, make it safe, and pan all the fines and see what I can find. Okay, so I'm actually going to give away two of these crystal clear vials. So, not what's in here, but some of this stuff. So, all you have to do is like, subscribe, and comment on this video. And I will pick out two of you guys to receive one of these. So pretty much weighing 20 grams per vial, all of these crystals you see in this pan. Right, so if you want to win that, then subscribe, like, and leave a comment. Cool, cool. So also not to forget about this beautiful piece that was found in the gold mine. Um, so this piece represents pretty much what these do. So down at the bottom is where your gold is and all these bugs and decaying material. And then you have a beautiful crystal cavity up here, which would have been a pocket and it's been busted open. So all these things, including this and all these come from a gold mine. So, pretty cool. Okay, so we just panned that bucket of material with acid in it. Um, and there's actually no gold, just a lot of pyro. But that's right. We still got all of these beautiful pieces cleaned up. And that's really cool. So if you guys have enjoyed this video, would be appreciated if you put the thumbs up, subscribe, and leave a comment. And you are watching AU Prospecting. I'll see you next video.